the original gimbals that came with the Radio Master Zorro or Radio Master TX12 were, well, not the best one, not the worst one, well, let's say somewhere in the middle with pointing rather down than up. In a scale between 1 and 5, somewhere around 3. Comparing to full-size radio options like, for example, AG01 gimbals you could get for the TX16S, those smaller radios were... they were losing the fight. Luckily, now we have the Radio Master AG01 Mini, which fit to the Radio Master Zorro and the Radio Master TX12. The Radio Master AG01 Mini gimbals look like a scaled down version of the full size AG01, and this is 100% accurate assumption. Those are scaled down and simplified AG01s. You get the CNC aluminum frame, you get the CNC aluminum mechanics and the same sensor. However, you lose. You lose some of the adjustments. Unlike the full-size AG01, on the minis you can only adjust the movement in one of the axes. There is no from the top adjustments on the tension and the centering. If you do want to adjust the tension and the centering, you have to do it from inside of the radio using traditional screws. Okay, the AG01 Mini are now installed in the Zorro. They look nice, they work nice. However, the process unfortunately of installing them in the Zorro is not as simple as I hoped because you have to, well, first, disassemble everything including the main PCB and all the wires then replace the gimbals assemble again and unfortunately it takes a lot of time swapping gimbals in the TX16S is much simpler but with enough time and enough effort this too can be done the final question is are those AG01 mini a worthy upgrade to the Zorro and the TX12? Are they any good? Are they worth the upgrade? And the answer is that depends. First of all, they are much better than the original Radio Master Zorro gimbals. No discussion about that. They are smoother, bearings feel better and you have a nicer precision. You just feel the difference in your fingers when you are flying. So yeah, if you want to have the best gimbals for Zorro or TX12, the AG01 Mini are the gimbals for you. However, they are not as good as the full-size AG01. First of all, not all of the adjustments are available from the top of the gimbal. From the top of the gimbal you can only change up and down travel limit. If you want to change the spring tension or set up the centering, you have to do it from the bottom of the gimbal and that means you have to disassemble the radio. Yes, I know, the Zorro have some adjustment screws over here, but you know what? Maybe I did something wrong, but those screws are not hitting the contact surfaces on the gimbal. So I can turn them, but nothing changes. So if you want to adjust the tension of the springs, you have to open the radio, disassemble anything, and this is major pain in the ass. Maybe, maybe with the TX12 it's working better. However, because I don't have the TX12, I cannot change. I cannot tell. I can only tell that with the Zorro, this is kind of irritating trait. Maybe I'm doing something wrong? This happened before? I might be just plain stupid. And I have some reservations for the throttle tension option. Maybe it's only the feature of the gimbals I got, but the throttle is not the smoothest throttle ever. Sure, if you apply some grease on the tensioning bar, it's better. However, they do not give you any grease with the AG01 Mini. They only give you grease with the full-size AG01. If you would like to know more about radios and gimbals, here is the video for you. Watch it, you might learn something interesting. I'm Paweł Spychalski, thank you very much for watching and, like always, happy flying!